Okay, so I wanted to show you a different view of the admixtures, utilities. Um, I'm going right back to the Eurogenes because, like I said, it's my favorite one. So let's do the Eurogenes, but this time instead of doing the admixture proportions uh, with the link to the Oracle, well, what we're going to do is do the admixture proportion by chromosome. Now, uh, the first thing, obviously, that you're going to do is you're going to put in your kit number and choose whichever item, uh, whichever version that you want. Now, typically, I always uh, suggest going to K36, but it's going to get very hectic on this uh, um, next screen if you do the K36, but you should give it a try. Um, now, it does take a little bit longer to load this screen than it did, uh, the screen with the Oracle. But it's going to go through and do chromosome by chromosome. Um, and it's going to load each and every one of them. And then you're going to get a list. Now, uh, the benefits of doing this is you're going to be breaking down everything. Um, if you're just trying to, uh, like, get an ideal. And, um, like, say, you know that... Um, you match uh, this person or that person on this chromosome. You can start looking at those different chromosomes uh, matches and start saying, well, you know that, like, not the screen is completely loaded anyways. Um, uh, just... Pick one out, you know, if I go to chromosome 2, um, you know, it says that chromosome 2 gives me um, all these different uh, versions here. And obviously the darker the, the color is the largest amount. So it's just another little uh, way to look at your DNA. It's always there. Um, and it tells you how much it went through. Most of my colors being obviously in here, like, um, basically. All of your chromosome uh, should, like if we're looking at your chromosomes, uh, in each one to 100%, you know, like, um, it, you know, this one would be 13 for Eastern European, um, 9, almost 10% for French, and then it, it basically should add up to somewhere around there. Um, this is my matches, obviously. Yours are going to be different. But it gives you a whole, like, rundown of, of how, like, which chromosome comes up, um, which different way. Um, so that you know that, say, you have Joe Bob or something, and you know that you match them on chromosome 9, well, you know that chromosome, chromosome 9, you can go through and say, oh, well, you know, you have, uh, you have some Basque, uh, Central European, you know, you just go down through, and it's just an extra little blanket, I guess, um, it's not something I, I would use always, but it's, it, it's just something extra there for you to look at, basically. It's just that breakdown, breakdown of each chromosome and, and how it breaks down.